To her, the film is a sweeping epic, unlike anything that's been made for a very long time. What impressed you about Black Gold when you initially read the script and made you want to devote your time to it? First, it was the journey of, uh, of the, the character and uh, the, the area when, uh, where uh, the movie is, uh, is settled and uh, the, the different themes that we have in this uh, uh, huge, uh, sp spectacular movie. That was something uh, new. And how would you describe Auda, your character, when we first get to meet him in the film? He's a bit of a bookworm, isn't he? Yeah. He's called the Kingdom's Librarian by his... Uh, by he, his is. Yeah. he is. He uh, is. I think he's uh, someone who's got many trauma, and uh, he hide himself in books. He found another way to, uh, to, 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 look, to, to, to look the life, I would say. And uh, he's going he's gonna to try to defend an, uh, uh, an idea of peace. And uh, to, to have peace, he, he will learn that he has to, to, to go to war. And Auda has to marry Princess yeah. Leila, played by Fr Frida yeah. Pinto. Not quite as bad as it might seem, <laughs> though, I guess. How would you describe the dynamics between that couple? The, the, the what? Um, just the relationship between ah, the two. It's uh, an absolute love relationship, but complicated at the beginning. It's, it's absolute, absolute, he is absolutely honest with her because he could have, uh, he could have done everything with her by, uh, by this uh, fake uh, wedding. But he says, no, it's a, it's a trap. He tried to, um, he stayed on it, honest, really. And then this is a real love story between them. And the men who essentially play your two dads in the film, yeah. Antonio Banderas as Nassib and then Mark Strong as Amar, how would you describe the relationships that Auda has with them? I mean, he's got quite divided loyalties in a way, hasn't he, between the two? Yeah, I think he, w with, uh, with uh, King Nassib, he has a, uh, a good relationship. I mean, uh, he raised him up with uh, respect and love, and as a son, but not completely. And uh, so he learned a lot uh, in in watching him uh, leading the his uh, his country. And uh, when he he goes back to his uh, his own uh, kingdom, he's gonna discover discover someone different than uh, what he was thinking of. And uh, he's going to fall in love again uh, uh, with his father and uh, learn from him all, uh, all, all, all that lack, in, uh, all the elements that lacks in, uh, in, uh, in the sea. And Antonio Banderas, as I mentioned, and Mark Strong play these uh, two men. How would you describe your experience of working with these two acting powerhouses? <laughs> <laughs> very nice. It was something uh, very interesting, and I learned a lot from them. I mean, uh, in in their way, they're they're from two different schools, I can say, and uh, it's like uh, Prince Auda. I learned uh, from them too. Mm. Um, and you also star alongside the brilliant British actor Riz Ahmed, who uh, mm. brings quite a sort of wry sense of humour, I think, to Auda's half brother Ali. And um, how would you describe the relationship between these two, and what kind of forges the bond between them? At the beginning, I think uh, it's not uh, it, it doesn't work with. Him. Because they are, he's got something deep inside. He's uh, he's got anger because uh, because of his father, and uh, he's gonna find another brother in him, really, because he lost his one, with whom with whom he he, he was raised. So he's gonna find another family in him, and uh, maybe uh, the only one who could really speak with him, because they are um, they're intellectual, both of them. And just finally, Jean-Jacques um, Anno has given us many memorable films over the years, but what for you marks him out as one of France's leading filmmakers and what did he bring to Black Gold? I'm sorry. Um, what marks uh, Jean-Jacques Anno, yeah. what, what makes him such a brilliant filmmaker, really? Ah, because he can make... Uh, really, I think he's, he's part of a s small... Not, not a lot of directors could, can do what he's doing. I mean, uh, a huge movie, very popular with, uh, with uh, different themes and uh, a message. Yeah. Tahar Rahim, thanks very much. All the best You're with welcome. Black Gold. Thank you. Thank you.